another episode of Super Reaction Bros. I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we finally have something we can finally talk about because every time it's about, to talk about. It's, a, it's about to happen or it's a going on our way. No, it's, they get so canceled. as far back as 2008, 13 years ago, there's always been talk of doing an adaptation of Why the Last Man. Yeah, the DC. The letter Y, the last yeah, man. Yeah, the DC um, Comics adaptation. Yeah. Yes. Very well known, very critically well received. It's, of course, a story about what would happen if there was only one man left on Earth. One man and what, what was that? One man and one male capuchin monkey. Yeah, that's what it is. Basically. So, yeah, that's um, what it is. Yeah. as far back as 2008, it's been originally going to be a film. It was supposed to be, it's a post-apocalyptic type of film where all the men will pretty much it's like have in a way died off or killed off or stuff like that. But they're the only two, like the like I said, the monkey and him are the only two actual males pretty much in the whole world. Yeah, start off it was going to be a film, then transition to a series, and then right when they were about to put in production on that series, that series got canned. Yeah. And now we're here for. They originally had and then they originally had Shia LaBeouf attached to it a while back. A long time ago. I know Zachary Levi was always interested in playing the main role. Yeah, Zachary Levi was interested. I know, but like I said, though, Shia LaBeouf was supposedly at, was attached to, I think, the first the actual film they wanted to do. But that, like I said, that, that didn't pan out. And then after that, like I said, Zachary Levi was interested, you know, in the role. Um, like I said, it's just, it's been in produ production hell. This is a story that has been big. They've been trying to do. But always something always comes up or something always throws it off to where they have to cancel it and can't do it. So the now So the newest version of it is the one we're actually getting. It's actually finally coming. getting and it's, it's coming series to uh, it's coming to us uh, from the writer of the killing. Yes. Um and yeah, good that's series. Yeah, good series. Um you've seen more than I have of it, but I, I trust your word on that. Um but yeah, I don't know what to expect from this. I've heard great I've always heard great things about the original the story, novel. yeah, the, 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 the original comic it's based off of is like it's been great great it, it's got so many reviews that's why i come everybody this is the story that everybody been wanting to try to do because the story is so good but there are times it feels like the productions were hesitant and got scared because it's like they didn't want to take that yeah. risk or yeah there's a multitude of reasons like the first two attempts at doing an adaptation where movies yeah. film flopped but they had our own reasons but i'm just glad it's finally happening so yeah right now we're only taking a look at this quick teaser that's why we talk and so much again it's coming I, I guess it's coming to fx yes uh fx on hulu or whichever they want to call it uh but they come in it's coming to fx but just a quick teaser to take a look at get a get a, a kind of like an idea of what's going to probably be like or that tone or feeling is going to feel like when watching this series so let's dive into this for the official teaser trailer or entitled uh, this teaser trailer is called gone but this is for why the last man so here we go Yeah, see, it's it's FX show, but it's gonna be streamed yeah. primarily on Hulu. Yeah, it's gonna. Yeah, it's one of those things. Yeah, yeah. September thirteenth. Yeah, September. Um, Maybe we get in our chair, probably explain some things, because like I said, I don't know the full story. I know the basic plot, and that's really it. Yeah, it's it's all I know from it. Like again, it's like all I know is that, like you said, he he travels around. He he's just a traveler, pretty much. Right? You know, moving around, and he moves around with this capuchin monkey, pretty much. And what I read is that they're the they are only the only male pretty much species that's left on the earth because really? ha this happens to not only just humans but also animals. That's the thing, pretty much. And that's what's going down here. It says that they're the last males on this whole earth. Yeah, this is one of those, like, when Walking Dead, for, I think it's just a million times, I'll say it in here. Like, with Walking Dead, I won't mind reading the original. Uh, I don't know how it ends. Um, I, I, that's just a basic concept that I, that, we, that I know of, at least. But I don't know how the comic ends or how it fully ends, the graphic novel. I don't know if, uh, if they have a set 
ending for this, I would think they would have to, because compared to The Walking Dead, The Walking Dead, you could literally just keep going and going and going, because it's The Walking Dead. This is to completely different. It's like you got one man traveling around the world, or at least traveling, pretty much, and all he has around him is just nothing but women. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm interested to see where it goes. I know a lot of people are fans of this, uh, this series, the actual comic, are actually generally psyched for this. I know they've been waiting quite a while to see if <laughs> anybody could translate this uh, story to and film. Like I said, or it's one of those stories, I think it's, it's, it's what, what it is, is like either they're too hesitant because the story's too good and they don't want to take that risk, or they just don't think it's going to work. And even though, like, it, it'll work if you get the right people attached to it. Yeah, it, like I said, you can look more into why, like, the original movie adaptation Why failed. the movie, and then the, why the, the, the first time they tried to attempt to do the series uh, failed, and then, and then pretty much finally dive into this generation of why they finally made it succeed. Um, but we'll have to see. Um, can we see an actual trailer, actual footage, just to get a rough idea of what the show's going to be like, how it's going to be like, and what's gonna go down. Yeah, so other than that folks, if you're new to the channel, you hit the like button if you wanna to talk to us more about stuff like this. Comment down below if you wanna share this around, share it around. And if you like it's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about FX slash Hulu original series, hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what your guys' thoughts are on this. I mean, not only teaser, but just overall, the excitement level, or if you've been waiting for this this comic to actually come to life, to come to either film or series, how excited you are, and um, are you hesitant for it? Are you excited for it? Are you just, you know, you really can't wait to see where they're going to do with the show, how they're going to pull it off, things like that. I mean, let us know what your guys' excitement level is. Is it high, low? I mean, let us know in the comments below. Put down what you thought of our reaction and thoughts on why the last man so thank you for watching you nailed it there so until next time folks i'm chris i'm christopher and this has been a very last man filled episode of srb see you later hey guys thanks for watching if you want to check out any of our previous reactions as well as one of our other srb shows check out one of the playlists down below and if you want to check us out in the social universe you can find us on twitter and start us at super react bros as well as on facebook at super reaction bros